and you're creepy to some body voice when we're in bed and yeah, everything's great. Yeah, but I did great. it wrong last time. One second. <clears throat> okay. Oh, you're in a redo. Mulligan. Mulligan, everyone. Ooh, man, I should be a creepy disembodied voice more often. Anyway. Right. Hello. It's time for us to go. I wonder if we're going to look the same again. I bet his eyebrows are even bigger. Excuse oh. me. Her eyebrows are even bigger. She got mascara in it this time. You do know that mascara doesn't go in your eyebrows, right? I was thinking eyelashes. <laughs> I was thinking eyelashes. Anyway, the look on your face was you know, like, oh no. A <laughs> hundred years I've been waiting to get another go at Mormo. So let's ski daddle. Oh, I guess I'm awake and just hopping out of bed. I'm so glad. Okay. Am I. Do, do I have pants on? Yeah, they're purplish. Are they? Because they look like they're the same color as like my skin. Oh my and, god. Oh I'm my a god, blockhead. you're a blockhead. All right, well, at least we're different now. Can I like. Play. Is this is this a Super Nintendo right here? Like, can I? I would like to. It doesn't let me. All right. All right I can't do anything. Just a yeah. weird blockhead. Yeah. Well, I can't do anything either. It's fine. It's just not just a you problem. Oh, it's raining. Oh, it looks uh, the same. It looks the same. It's so gross out here nowadays. Amazing what Vormo can do to a place in a century. What? You have no idea who I am or what you're doing. Fine. I'll give you a quick intro. Ready? You are the latest sort of ditto. In short, run around, overcome trials, vanquish Mormo, get to go back to your everyday life, blah, blah, blah. Look, I know I'm rushing you, but we've got a very limited time, okay? Well, once you get your hands on the sword, it'll all come flooding back. Muscle memory or something beats me. The sword should be its with its last owner, which means the graveyard. Follow my marker. This is not a great way to start this. All right. I just don't know how I feel about having a square head. And by square, I mean cube. I mean... Because geometry. Yeah, I mean, geometry's kind of a thing, but, like, you know. I mean, why do you gotta have a round head? Yeah, I mean, really, this is just head-ist. Head I, I don't look, man. I didn't know. I got stuck in a bush. I got I'm stuck just, in trees, so okay, okay, this is fine. Everything's completely fine, and all right. Urgh, I've got a weird feeling in my stomach, and I don't think it's leftover poop I had for breakfast. Gross! Let's head for the grave before something icky pops out. Pops out of you, or like... Maybe he's or she's prairie dogging, who knows? Maybe <laughs> she's prairie dogging? Oh my god. Alright, A. And there, we're doing the human centipede thing again. Hey! Now you have a silver Wonder Woman thing. As you take the sword from the grave, you feel a mystic power coursing through your veins, imbuing the strength of your forebearers, which is apparently not enough. Uh, I've become the sword of Ditto. Great. Oh, I get to press A. Hey, we got an achievement! Ta-da! We finally have our sword of Ditto. I like how it stopped raining immediately. That's also kind of concerning. Our surroundings might give it away, but the last one didn't go so well. Still means it'll be hard for you to do worse. I, I, mean, I guess that's one way to look at it. Sometime I might not have, wait, something I might not have mentioned is that we've only got a few days to prepare before you have to face Mormo. Five days, to be precise. Why is it always five days? Oh. <laughs> Once five days have passed, it's time to go kick her scaly butt. But don't worry, it's more than enough time to get everything done. Okay, they still didn't actually explain that. Oh, but now we have health thingies. Oh, hey, look at that. Great. Listen to me going on though. We need to get to the, we need to get to the town so we can get some directions. I'll mark it on your map. Oh shit, we got a map now? Oh god, we have a map! It looks like a three-year-old drew it. I mean, look, at least a five-year-old. Those lines are far too straight. What is the roar in the corner? What is that? And there's a bomb drawn on the page. I have a lot of questions. I also definitely thought we were at White Look Corpse. Eh, definitely thought that's what that said. Five, five days, days until the sh Okay, I'm a little, I'm like, why five days? What's in here? That's a creepy dude. We talked to the creepy dude. Did you pick me up? I did, oh, I picked you no. up. Oh, yeah. Oh, no. Now we just need a trench coat. I can't, oh, oh, I can jump off by myself. Okay, so that's good. Okay, so wait, how did I do that? Pick, there we go. And if I, you, I can roll to I get off. I want to try and throw you. But I can't, okay, I'll stop jumping off then. Pick and throw. No, mm, okay. Only kind of. Anyways. Hey, the name's Flop. I'm the number one Marmo fan on this island. No one else comes close. 
She's just so amazing. Who else around here deserves such devilish fabulosity? Not you, that's for sure. Fabulosity. Anyway, if you want to get your mormorabilia. Oh my god, mormorabilia. Oh, fuck it, that word. This is the place to come. Mormo's my queen. I stand for Mormo. Okay. Let's like look at what the gear is. Let me see what there is. Uh, Thing you can add the ether element. Oh my god. All right. So. Boy. The regular. Ooh, I want a new regular brain. Gross. I've I've got one for you right here. Uh. St stuff. That's cool. a head. We can get stuff. Okay. All right. We're gonna chat. All right. Cool. Do you know that like Mormo is the strongest e uh, ether weaver in the world, probably of all time. Don't come for me, boo. These are just the facts. Oh my Interesting. god. Interesting. I think okay. that's it. Yeah, we got we gotta leave. I'm very cool. uncomfortable. May Mormo darken your day. Well then. He's very goopy looking. But he's got like the emo goopy hair. Emo goopy hair. Yep. Can't even read that. Oh, I wanna ride the stagecoach. Stage oh, so oh, this is probably a quick a quick travel thing. Oh, you're right. Then we eventually get to. Oh, hey, it's my oh, turn. Oh yeah. Whoop. Yeah, I just push it down. Do we still walk on water? We can. Yeah. Look, it's the not Yoshi egg. Oh. No, that's right. I don't have a sword yet. So oh, I do have a sword. Never yeah. Mind. <laughs> it's like we literally just got it. That was like a whole thing. Oh, sweet. You can get money out of grass. Yes. Kill all of it. All the grass. Now you gotta be careful. We share money apparently. So like. So this can't be like a Stardew Valley. This thing. cannot be a Stardew Valley thing. Can I like pick up the rocks? Oh, I can. Oh, I got coffee. Oh, hell, you got coffee? Yeah. I'll have to look in our inventory in a second. Yeah. You left money on the ground. God, you're so irresponsible. Yes. All I do is cut. Win, and win, tape. win, no matter what. <laughs> Thank you. I got money that. on my mind. All right. Are we, are we moving on now? <laughs> yes. I like how much, like, how efficient of a ball we can roll into. Oh, yeah. Into. This is very Metroid. Very Samus. We're oh. Armadittos. Oh no. Okay, the old guy should be in the Hall of Swords. Let's go check it out. The old guy. What do we know what old guy we're supposed to be talking to? Ooh, oh. ooh, and while we're here, let's grab a travel kazoo too. It'll save you a lot of legwork in the long run. I'm gonna guess it costs money we don't have. Probably. Oh god. All sorts of other Oh things. the toy shop! And it's definitely worth checking out the toy shop too. I mean for work purposes, obviously. What is that bird man doing? Did you see that? Yes, I did. Okay, well, let's... It's Dittodale! This uh, is a different a town. Welcome to Air... Oh, <clears throat> excuse me. Welcome to Air Kazoo. Could I see your identification, please? Uh... Well, I'll be a new customer. It's been a while since we've had one of those. Let me just find my new user script. Ahem. Welcome to Air Kazoo. In order to utilize our instant musical travel services, please take this complimentary kazoo. Oh, you just like have it. We now have a travel kazoo. Press Y to summon the air kazoo. Transit bus or to exit a dungeon. Cool. To travel air kazoo, simply locate and activate the air kazoo beacons you find around Ditto. Cool. You can only travel to an active beacon, so be sure to activate them when you find them. I'll activate this one for you now. <laughs> oh my god. I fucking love this game. Assign your travel kazoo to the thing from your bag with the other thing. <laughs> and use it with the Y button to summon our air kazoo bus. Have a nice day and thank you for flying air kazoo. Cool. Uh, so we need to assign the things. We don't automatically have things. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, um, so I like how it, like, gave us a symbol. Um... It gave us a symbol, but didn't actually, like, it's not on these controllers. All right, so we got a chocolate bar, which I'm going to guess gives you health. I'm going to guess those things give you health. Ew. Mormo's bathwater. Gross. Okay, so I, ass so I assigned it. So okay. I think you will have to um, go to your menu. My menu. And I can assign yeah, it. Yeah, then you can assign it. So, so I click. Yeah. And... Oh, there you go. You signed it to your top button. Where does it tell me? Right oh, fucking there. Okay, right cool. there. Awesome. <laughs> you literally just did it. Oh, we get stickers? Hell so wait, yeah. okay, so there's bags. So how do I get to the other? Oh, left button. There's other buttons on the controller. It even tells you right there. You know, that's why I found out. That's it's okay. why it's right there. Okay. All right. Cool. Oh my god. Cool. Okay, you good? Um, yeah, whatever. All right. We're gonna go in this house. We're, I don't know if we can. All right, we can. That's right. You said explore. 
I did say that. I did Hello, say Hello, person. It, I've got an amazing Mormo costume for the party next week. Oh, that's why we have to kill Mormo in five days. It's, we had to do it before the party. Ah. I don't know if that's why. That's just what I've decided on. What? You think it might be a little insensitive? I don't remember asking for your opinion. Oh, is he supposed to be dressing up as, like, the previous sort of ditto? Is that what this is? Dude, coffee machine. Let me use your coffee machine. <sighs> I want to pick up this helmet. Oh, got it. Oh, Look can at I this pick helmet. him up? Oh, I can't. Oh. No, I tried it, but I was like, maybe I got I, behind I him. I gently set the helmet down. Why can't I? I want to just kill it. I want to, like, break your shit. You just throw it. There we go. Okay. Hey, yeah, we got so money from this dude. I'm down with that. Cool. That's that's gonna be us. We're gonna be the money stealing Great. bandits. So it's gonna Birds. be exactly like a Zelda game. Come here, oh person. yeah, a star over your head. That's probably important. Damn it! I've really messed up this time. Mom's gonna kill me. This experimenting with scent triggers. Whoa! I accidentally concocted something irresistible to all the slugs on the island. That sounds fucking terrible. You help me, great. I didn't say that. I think if you kill about ten of them, that should do the trick. Call it a hunch. All right, so that's how we get quests, if they have stars over their heads. Okay, so normal video game logic. Normal video game logic. Which is obvious to me, maybe not as much to you. My grandfather. <clears throat> no, I just did that voice. <clears throat> do you want me to do a female voice? No. Okay. I'm, I'm going to do this one. Okay. Um, uh, okay, hold on a second. Um, find the voice. Find it. My grandfather spent most of his life down on the beach. <laughs> he was a fisherman. Always sat there, line cast, hat half cocked over his eyes. Mm -hmm. I have often gone down after school and played with him. He'd tell me stories of the sea, about his big catches and the ones that got away. Ah, I wish I could do the same with my kids, but it's just not safer enough these days. Who knows what would crawl out. See, that was a perfect female voice. Yeah, that was super great. Ooh, a monster extermination firm. Smith & Sons are best for your pests. That one needs word smith. Word shopping? No, it's word smithing. Work shopping. Oh. And I'm know, honestly not sure what it said anymore. I just know that none of the words you said were right. Awesome. <laughs> <laughs> Maybe they were left. Ooh, fancy. Oh, I like There's this. a red button. Oh, God. I think it's a power button. I think that's a screen. All right. Let's listen to this old man talk. It looks like an old turtle. Yeah, it kind of does look like an old turtle. Cool. All right, your Togo. Tell me, little one, is that a giant dung beetle floating there? Or has my sen senility finally caught up with me? I thought you were going to say my sensitivity. I, I didn't know what I was going to say. Then it's really you, Puku. Sure is. You're the sword keep, right? One and the same. I was concerned my time may pass without this coming to bear. My, like, my poor grandfather. Aw, oh, boo-hoo. <laughs> poor one out for grandpa. I presume you're here to discern the location of the anchors, am I correct? Perhaps not, given the blank look on your face. Have you explained anything, Puku? Does this poor child even know about Mormo? Of course they do. I think. I did mention that stuff to you, didn't I? Cuckoo, you need to start taking this more seriously. The last sword didn't even survive long enough to make it to our hall. Oh, that's not good. Well, we were there. No, we, the, no, we, a hundred years passed. There have been other ones. Oh. Remember that was that whole exposition at the beginning? But I thought we were just like the last one. Never mind. Well, if what we're here fuck? now, that just means that I'm definitely improving, right? Okay, okay, you're right. I get the message. I'm not sure you do, Puku. That failure 100 years ago has caused immeasurable sorrow for the people of Ditto. Her monsters have spread across the island, and Mormo's wicked rule has sapped our little remaining hope. That last faint gleam of hope is this sword, here, now. They are all that stand between our salvation and a descent further into darkness. And that means we need a proper plan of action to take Mormo down, right? Correct. Your next move should be to destroy Mormo's anchor. It's one of the instruments of her regeneration and binds her to this realm. Her minions have squirreled it away deep within Ditto's cavernous underbelly. To access said chamber, you require one of the toys of legend. Ooh, kinky. Yeah. Here, I've marked on your map the location of where I believe you'll be able to find the necessary... Necessary <laughs> toy. Sorry, I'm very old and forget words sometimes. Puku will guide the way. Cool. Oh, look, there's a circle. We're going to the blank spot. Means we have to go back through the graveyard. Maybe. Maybe. Oh, Maybe. I don't know. Can we click on All the... Right. Can, we, can we do... I just want to be an armored guy. Like I just want to be the very best. Like no one ever was. Does he have more to say? Oh! Ooh, look at all this. Oh, no, it's, this is just like hint stuff. Oh, it's like, never yeah, mind. We, we know all those things. All right, we're leaving? Oh! oh. 
the first hero. This painting depicts the first sword of Ditto in their decisive battle with Marmo. Not pictured, the first sword keep who helped them to their victory. We invite visitors to draw their own con their own conclusions. I can't put the emphasis on the right syllable. God, and I even like fucked up my fucking it up. The old world, this one of the few remaining portraits we have of the Arca Arcadians? Yeah, I was yep. right, Arcadians, or the ancient ones as they conquer colloquially known. Have you ever seen the word colloquially it's written out before? Probably not. Okay. With an empire that eventually spanned the empire entire world they live yeah. peacefully in <laughs> wait, 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 wait. an empire that eventually spanned the entire it would then it spanned the, the empire. empire world yeah, yeah okay yeah. cool just want to make sure uh, we all technologies learn. blah 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 the world fell into civil war almost complete extermination of the human race while we still don't understand the reasons why we still benefit from their technological advances to this day even if it may still remain beyond our scientific reckoning I like how there's a thing about the human race, but like you're definitely a blockhead and there's definitely a fucking talking turtle and a floating dung beetle. Whatever. The trials! Ditto has long been a special place, even as far back as the ancient ones. People came to the island to test themselves upon coming of age. The Arcadian people erected a complex system of trial chambers on the island for this very purpose, which still reside beneath the surface today. There's they whips and chains and everything else you gotta overcome. <laughs> You know what, I'm not even gonna go there. They cannot be accessed under normal circumstances. The trial chambers also house the toys of legend. Ah, oh, shit, we're going there. And are thus inextricably linked to the Sword of Ditto's enduring quest to quell Mormo's uprising. Got their chains and whips. Those are the toys of legend. <laughs> fate, the benevolent. A portrait of fate, the god of destiny. It just looks we like know a... fate was a god very much respected by the ancient ones, especially towards the end of their civilization. <laughs> Indeed, it's believed that fate was heavily involved in the Arcadian politics, quite whether they really existed or remains of the <laughs> It's safe to say that they, no one has seen them for a great many centuries. You okay over there, honey? Nope. You doing alright? No, probably not. Jesus Christ. Okay, well, how about we continue our adventure that direction uh, next time? Okay. Give me that bird! Maybe we'll find some of those. Like, you're just, you're gonna make me throw up. Are you okay? Oh my god. Wait, what? Like, I just noticed that as you walk, the thing on your head lights up. Oh my god, that's amazing! Holy shit! That's why I was getting so dizzy while you were like doing this. It was just going bananas. Oh, danger, oh my Will god. Robinson! Danger! Dude, there's like fireflies. This is really pretty. All right, next time we'll investigate the danger this this hey. this way. Oh god. Hey. 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 Oh. <gasps> Rude. I was just giving her a haircut. Just a haircut. Maybe she doesn't want a haircut. I'm sorry. Did you not want a haircut? Too bad. It was. Oh my god! You're trying to like murder people. Come here. You can't be trusted. I can't remember what button it is to pick you up. Oh god. I didn't mean to do any of that. I for, I almost used my thing. Oh no! Oh, I don't... no! Look what you did! God damn it! All right. Next time. <laughs>